folks, another guitar lesson here, um, another deep track. Uh, we're going deep on this one. I Lie Around by Paul McCartney, sung by Denny Lane, most of it at least. I think it was recorded during the Ram Sessions, um, the flip side of Live and Let Die, I believe. And then I really rediscovered this great song um, on the Red, Red Rose Speedway reissue, which I'm really digging into now. I love it. And there'll be more lessons coming from Red Rose Speedway, some great tunes there, and most of them are hidden gems. So we'll start with this one off Red Rose Speedway. Or I'll call it that. Um, the guitar is in standard tuning. Uh, the song's in key of E major. There's no capo. Um, and that major, the riff that pretty much plays throughout the song, we'll cover the other parts real quick as well. Um, let me give you the chords first. Um, very basic chords, E, E major, then an E seventh. Um, you do have to add your pinky on the second string, um, third fret, the D note, gotta add that, it's important. Um, then to an A, then to a D, back to A, and then a B. And I do play the B barred on the second fret. So again, the chords real quick, E, E seventh, A, D, A, B. Now the picking pattern, and again, I'm not a technical guitarist, so um, pretty much all the picking is going from the lower string up three strings. Um, so I hope that makes sense. So on the, the original E, the first E chord, I am hitting the bottom bass E as well, but you're basically picking from the bottom string. I can't see my hand. Um, but I'm not gonna worry about too much of those fingers. Um, you can hear it. Um, but the E chord from the bottom three strings, the one, two, three strings up. So it's, then you add the E seventh. Same thing, except you're starting on the second string, three up, two, two, three, four. So to A, and then you hit the open E. And then you're going to do the D and the A and the B. And the D and the A, you're going to do the one, two, three strings again. D, A, B, B. And then you hit, oh, sorry, I missed it. You hit the F sharp there. So let me try that as slow as I can. I don't know if I can do this slow. It's almost impossible to play that riff without tapping your foot. It's it's a great little riff, a great guitar riff. Um, so that's it. Um, that's played throughout the song, the intro, the outro, and on the verses. Um, the I Lie Around part, the, the basic chords are just A, E, B. I Lie Around. Um, I do, when I play it, I play the A at the fifth fret. Kind of the A, open A, I'm not sure what you call it. And then I play the E at the fourth fret. A over E maybe, I'm sorry, E over A, and then the B I play more, so, you know. And then you hold the B. All over the place. This is an E, E7, A7, so E or E7, and then you're adding the pinky. And then the A7, you're adding your pinky or whichever finger um, on the bottom G string. So, so. All over the place. Piece three times. Then back to E7. just an E or an E7 adding the C sharp to the D on the second second string second and third uh, frets so. and it's back to this beginning yes 
I'm tapping my foot. <laughs> So that's the song. I, I really do love this song. I think Denny Lane sings this wonderfully. I mean, I'd love to hear Paul sing the whole song, but um, it's a great uh, effort by Denny Lane. Uh, really a hidden gem and one, if you don't know this song, uh, check it out. It's worth, uh, it's worth a listen. So thanks again for watching. I appreciate it. I'm going to try to post some other lessons from Red Rose Speedway as I, I get through the songs and uh, have a great day.